Hi everyone, Crafty Mama here. How are you doing today? I hope you are having just a dandy fine day today. Well, what have I got going on in this video for you? I would like to share with you my Anna Griffin Vintage Valentine card toppers that I recently purchased a few weeks back from a sale on YouTube. Here's what the box looks like. I just adore everything Anna Griffin. Gotta be honest about it. <gasps> I do, I do, I do. I know there are a lot of people like me that do too. So here I'm just showing you. It always comes, uh, a lot of these collections she has comes in like this wonderful little portfolio or a little file box. And it's really pretty. And then it has Velcro closure on it to store the goodies inside. Let me take them out. Let's just go through. Let's take a look at these. I won't show you the doubles. There's 50. There's two of each of 25 designs. Here's the first one. To my love. And it's got pretty script in the back. It's got gold accents. And here's the thing with these. Even though they're real time, I took my one inch a punch. Punched out a white piece of card. You can cover that up and write whatever you want in it or, you know, stamp a design there. Like if you were to get these. So they're not just for Valentine's. There's a lot of things you can do with these. Um, here's another one just for you. Super pretty. And these look dimensional, but they are flat. It's all one except for the ribbon on some of them that's attached to the back. These are absolutely flat. So let me see. This is lots of love. The next one we have up. Again, pretty, pretty. This one says, to my friend. Most all of them have a little bit to a whole lot of gold foil accents on them. Beautiful colors, ribbons, either on the bottom, the side, somewhere. Um, some of them don't have ribbons. They're just like this one is very pretty. Warm wishes. You got to my sweetie with a butterfly. Those are all really pretty. Let me see. What else have we got here that's in this collection for my friend? Love all the pretty swirls around that. Again, it amazes me how these look like they're more than one piece, like they're layers, but they're not. They have that neat 3D look without that 3D bulk, which is really nice. And they can be used on greeting cards, can uh, put like a little hole at the top and some ribbon, hang them off a gift bag. I was even thinking some of these I may fussy cut apart for some of the uh, graphics on them and do my own little layers of things for ephemera and in my journals and things. I can make uh, ATC or uh, artist trading cards, ATC, MDC, memory decks cards with them. You know, like I said, doing a little bit of fussy cutting. I just think they're so darn practical and super duper pretty. This one I didn't think it had a saying, but it said to my love. I have a heart punch that if I didn't want to say to my love, I could just punch out another piece of red cardstock, put that right over there. Here's like a little uh, cherub, cherub there for my sister. You know, a couple of say different things for my mother. Of course, that's a real pretty um, big one. Some of these are, uh, they range in size from six to seven inches high. And they're from like about three to five inches wide, depending on. Uh, the size. I love the blue flowers here for my love. XOXO, you know, obviously could be used for real times, Christmas, friends, anytime. You know, get well, how are you, just to say hi, friend mail, all kinds of stuff. This is like my favorite. It's not only gorgeous, but it has a beautiful saying on it. Let me put it up a little closer so you can see. And it says, we rise by lifting others. How true is that? That's very true. Now, of course, all these toppers are perfect for card making. Yes, you know, that's what they're meant to do, what they're meant to be. You make your, you have your base, you can just use it as is, or you can decorate your base, your card base, use this as a layer, use it as your main focal point of your greeting card. They're good for five by seven cards, but you can cut them down to make the regular size cards. Like this one that I'm showing you is seven inches high, but you can cut it at the top and bottom to make it fit on the standard size five and a half by four and a quarter wide cards that most people like to make. Well, I hope you enjoyed looking at some of these Anna Griffin Vintage Valentine card toppers. 
I certainly enjoyed looking through all of them with you. Thanks so much for stopping by and watching Crafty Mama. Until next time, next video, bye-bye for now.